Hi, and welcome back to my channel, Small Intentional Steps. And here I am with an update to my garden. So in the back, what I decided to do was add some mulch to the open space. There was some brown mulch there, but I had put that in a couple of years ago. So I wanted to refresh the area by adding some black mulch. It just, to me, made it stand out a lot more. I used my hands to put it down. It took maybe an hour or so to do it, but there you go. It looks so much better to me. I need to get a couple more bags to kind of even it out all the way around, but I like how it turned out. See the difference with the dry area where the grass should be? But yeah, once I get a couple more bags, they were only $1.97 from Home Depot, I'll add them. But I think I did a great job. In this area, I think I may add a couple of those trees like my neighbor have, has. And they'll start off small. They're only like $10 or so, but I think I may put some trees in that area, add some more mulch to even the space out. And you know, I think it's gonna be great. Here, I'm gonna show you the progress of the vines that I planted so that they could grow up around this trellis. It's taken some time, um, but they are coming in. I've been working on it uh, during this summer, but again, it'll take some time for them to grow all the way up. And at some point, they'll grow all the way around, maybe in a couple of summers. So here's an update on the plants that I dug up from one area and planted them into another that needed it last year, and they're coming in pretty good. I'm excited about that. Didn't have to buy new ones. And here's the final part of my update. Hope you're enjoying this. Isn't that a beautiful turquoise color? I found those pots at Home Depot. There I moved up those tier tables from the other side of the yard there so I could create an experience. I love it. That large pot in the back, I hid that for about six years. The others are plastic and the flowers that are inside the smaller pots are annuals. The one in the larger one, those are perennials. And there were three of those that were in one bunch. So I broke them up, put them into the large pot and the two small ones on the bottom. So these lilies are perennials, and perennials mean that they're going to come back each year and bud like this. So I have to remove those perennials from the pots and put them into the ground. So these are annuals, and that's what was in the other plastic plants. That's a potato plant, potato leaf. And these two both will begin to pour over. Same thing here with the white ones. I added the potato leaf plant into a number of pots, my hanging pots, because again, I lost the flowers from a couple of weeks ago because it had gotten too cold. Here, these were the ones I showed you a couple of weeks ago or last week and they're budding. I'm not sure if I have a rabbit pulling those up or what, but I took them because they have roots still on the bottom and I transposed them into one of my plants, like here. And so I pushed it down into the dirt. I'm gonna give it some time and see what happens. Likely they should grow out like the others. So I hope you enjoyed this. I love the colors, the pots that I've created in this space with the stands. I hope if you have any ideas, feel free to add them in the comments and happy planting and gardening.